Thursday night football. Boom! Cowboys visiting the New Orleans Saints. The Cowboys are four point favorites in this game. Whew. So this this line was six. COVID news came out, dropped it down to four, four and a half. Uh, still like it. Still like the Saints. I, I when I first saw this number, my first thought was. That's just weird. They bumped it up to six. I, I thought that was interesting. As if they knew that CD was going to be back and that Cooper was going to be off the COVID list and that they'd have all their weapons. Then when the code news came out and it dropped, I, I kind of made more sense to me. It's like we're sitting here on Tuesday. We don't know who has COVID, who's out. The books aren't going to take that risk and leave a number so high because they already didn't like Dallas in this matchup. You could just tell by the way they hung this number. They knew that public was going to come in really heavy on Dallas and they didn't care. So the professionals come in now and the Saints. We don't even know if Kamar is playing. We don't know if Ingram playing. That's that's a big deal to us. So this is one of those. If you didn't get the six with the Saints, I would wait until game time to know if those guys are playing. If Kamar is in, if Ingram's in, love the Saints. This is a classic ball control, good defense with the Saints. Everyone's kind of giving up on the Saints at this point. They're done with them because that Bills matchup. I like it from the other way. That was just that was more about what the Bills were going to do. And and again, Trevor Simeon didn't look good in that game. He was due for one of those. He is a third string quarterback. But when he has his weapons back, when he has Ingram back, Kamara back, this is when you want to take the Saints at home in this kind of matchup. So for right now, we'll just wait until we see what the deal is with those guys. The money is coming in on the Cowboys. The bets are coming in on the Cowboys. Very good chance by the time this game gets to kickoff, the line does move. I don't know if it gets back up to six. It's probably still going to float around this four and a half or five and a half. Yeah, that sounds about right. Do we like it at five and a half? Like, is the concept here... Wait on the game, but if it's still at four and a half, take it at four and a half. I know you're going to bet it. Yeah, I already bet it, but I would just wait now at this point because you already missed the six. So, like, I don't see a drop in below four. Like you said, the public's going to keep coming in on Dallas regardless of the COVID news. That like yeah. people are out on the Saints. They 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 look at them when the bottom teams in the league, like they do with the Seahawks. So these are the kind of teams that people are just giving up on. So you're going to be able to get value on the Saints no matter what. 